Hi friends, in this video I will talk about custom request data mapping in a controller. So uh, there could be times when you forcefully need to do such kind of conversions. For example, if you have some business requirement that okay, we, we want to provide data in this particular format or, or, or this type. But on the other hand, you also need to ensure that you are able to map that data to a domain well to our object and 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 basically you are you are complying to coding standards that, that's what you want there could be any any other scenario where you need to do such conversion so let's see by example how you could do that conversion so basically uh, we will be using uh, this annotation in it binder which basically scans for uh, uh, these annotations and 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 binds the converters basically well custom converters basically so for, for this example I would be taking an enumeration and uh, we will try to see how we could do the conversion so this is a basic uh, Spring Boot application and well basically it's, it's also allowing you to create a REST controller and I would be running it on port 8080 and I got nothing here than a simple Spring Boot application configuration and in our test controller we have got this request uh, so it's uh, endpoint with slash cat data and we got uh, one request param customer type which is of type customer enumeration and our customer enumeration got these four values and uh, specifically uh, I, would, I would like to mention this block so here uh, basically this map contains uh, string to string to uh, customer type mapping and this get content type is is basically converting that string to this customer type so first let's let's run it without uh, the conversion and let's see what what error we will get and and when we, when we try to uh, when we try to send a request with our, our requirement or our required data so let's run it and i already got the call in postman set up for you so once it runs okay it's, it's it's about to run and then you will see uh, how, how our endpoint behaves so so my requirement is that uh, i should be able to send this value right as customer type not not this value okay so so in i mean my endpoint if you see i'm just returning uh, the customer dot name that's why uh, you will see such kind of output let me execute it for you but uh, see how it fails for now it is saying that it fails to convert the value of type string to the required type right and it says that there are nested exceptions and conversion have failed because the default conversion that is supported by uh, spring boot is this one so basically you should have freelancer all capital like this right now it works but our requirement was different. Our requirement, our requirement was this one. We needed to supply customer type as these, uh, these basically you could say camel case values or lower case values or capital case values, whatever you want to say it, right? Now, let's see how we could do that. So, I have got this annotation on this method and this method takes one parameter, web data binder and web data binder got one method that is a register custom editor which takes two arguments so first argument is the type which you want to register the converter for and the second argument is the converter itself so let's see what we got in the, our custom converter and then i will get back to init binder okay so here in custom converter you need to extend property editor support which got a method uh, set as text you need to override and well it shows you have to throw a legal argument exception okay and i have put it intentionally just to see what is the output and set value is the is the method that property editor has got this one which sets the value basically right and the get content type method that we just spoke about is basically uh, fetching the a customer type value based on the content type okay let's get back to init binder 
So if you go to the init binder annotation, it clearly states that this annotation identifies methods which initialize the web data binder which will be used for populating command and form objects arguments of annotated handler methods. So basically this is this is uh, like this supports all the arguments that support request mapping. So here we got request mapping right but but you could go, go in details uh, because we, we do not want to get into details of uh, how init binder has been written and and uh, other details but basically we would like to see a basic example of how we could use init binder to to do the conversion of our data okay so let me restart the application yeah you should be liking the background music i have been playing it is to cancel the background noises okay so it's running for us now now let's just get back here and this one it yahoo so it worked and you see uh, it printed the freelance to here so the converter basically got called now if i put it in all capital cases now you will see conversion error right well it says null pointer exception because uh, the reason is the, we haven't like the default handler was showing the conversion exception but here when we try to do customer dot get content type you get a null pointer right and when we try to set the value uh, here so it fails basically so if you go to con get content type when it tries to get the value it fails right all right so uh, that that was a very simple example of uh, how how you could use init binder, but uh, you you could you could make it as complex as you want. Your converter could be doing much more than this job, right? It could be having a lot of methods doing uh, different type of conversions for you. You might be throwing uh, illegal argument exceptions and any other type of exceptions. So uh, my my purpose is to 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 introduce you with the basic. Right, and then you could you could extend it to uh, whatever extent you want to. Hope hope that was uh, knowledgeable and informative. And yep, that's it for this video. Uh, thanks a lot, friends.